Hi friends, welcome back to a new video. In this video, I am share to you the details of easily refill method of Canon 057 black toner cartridge. This is empty toner cartridge of Canon 057. If you are a new viewer of this channel, like and subscribe this channel and click on the bell button to receive notification of new uploaded videos. Both sides of this toner cartridge are locked with pins. So, need remove the pins from both sides of the toner carriage for the first step of the refill process. Pins remove like this. This channel is based on printer information and many videos have already been uploaded about the latest printer unboxing and printer features. But recently, we started uploading videos of refill carriages. We share with you an easy way to refill toner carriages and in carriages of different brands. Many pupils refill by making a hole in the toner. But in this video, I will show you how to easily refill without hole. First prepare your workspace. Place paper towels or newspapers on a flat surface to protect your workspace in case you spill toner powder. Put on rubber gloves if you want to make sure you do not get powder in your hands. Printer manufacturers usually do not instruct to even encourage customers on how to refill a toner carriage in hopes that you will simply buy a new replacement cartridge. However, adding toner to a laser printer on your own in an expensive and easy alternative to purchasing a new to toner cartridge. After one or two refills, we recommend that you empty the waste toner container because otherwise a perfect printing quality cannot be guaranteed. Shake well this toner powder bottle before filling. In this toner container can fill 120 grams of black toner powder. Please note as well, refill toner and toner powder may cause serious health problems if not handled carefully. So we recommend always using breathing protections while refilling toner cartridge. Add small amount of toner powder step by step. After then, lightly shake container manually. This helps the powder to go into the tank smoothly. Furthermore, toner powder and refill toner can be highly flammable with an appropriate oxygen mixture. Purchase the proper type of toner powder that is compatible with your printer and its cartridge. Toner powders are different by grain size, chemical construction and weight. That is exactly why only the compatible type of toner powder will work with your cartridge. There are several types of toner but not separate ones for every single printer model. Most differ on features, not basic technology. In a pinch, a toner from a very similar model of printer will probably also work, but research or ask first.
after filling the toner powder to container this magnetic roll replace as before after then press on magnetic roll replace the clip on correct position After the refill, shake the carriage lightly from side to side, holding horizontally to ensure even distribution of the toner powder. After replacing the magnetic roll, rotate to both sides manually. If this magnetic roll does not turn, the roll is not properly placed. So check again and place it properly. If it rotates smoothly, go to the next step. Please note as well that you. should not touch the photoconductor drum in no case or expose it to direct sunlight this could lead to faulty print outs once the refill process is complete combine the two parts and place the pins on both sides everything is placed now but how to know toner is ready to use or not in the last step the opc drum rotate to both sides manually if this drum does not turn the drum is not properly placed so check again and place it properly if rotate the drum smoothly this mission is successfully completed and reinstall the toner carriage into your printer this video winding up now if you have any doubts or need to know anything more you can comment on this video see you on next video thanks friends thank you for watching goodbye